Set a yardstick or other straight edge across the hull and draw a line on the bow and stern frames. Screw a four inch high rectangular scrap of plywood to the bow and stern frames. Not the bow and stern tips, but the main frames. Make sure the scrap wood is narrower than the width of the hull. This will hold the hull four inches above the floor and square to the floor. Turn the hull upside down and set the hull on the floor or two sawhorses. Position the sawhorses so that they are level and located directly under the bow and stern frames. Walk along all of the plank seams and with one hand on the inside of the boat and the other hand on the outside of the boat, align all of the planks so that the seams are even. How does the boat look? This is your last chance to make adjustments. All of the plank seams should be smooth and fair. The boat should not be twisted or distorted. The bow and stern stems should be straight. The keel should be straight where it was pinned. Using your dental syringe, fill all of the outside seams with epoxy. Let the hull sit for 40 minutes. Then fill your dental syringe again, this time with some epoxy that has been thickened with wood flour. Squeeze another bead down any seam that has not been completely filled. Let the epoxy harden.